News here where a toddler is dead after a cement truck lost control and veered off Beltway 8 right near Wood Forest, again falling on the vehicle below. Thanks for joining us tonight, everyone. I'm Jonathan Martin. And I'm Rashi Vats. Let's go straight to Fox 26's Matthew Seedorf joining us live from the scene. Matthew, what do we know now? Well, Rashi, this is just tragic. We we're learning that a 22 month old boy has died from this crash. And if, if I step out of the way, you might be able to see a cement truck went off of the beltway, uh, likely from the rain, rainy conditions for the last few hours out here and fell onto wood forest on top of this car. There were four people inside this car, including two young uh, twins in the back seat and all three of Three of the people got out of the car, but one of the twins, unfortunately, did not survive. A 22-month-old boy did not survive this crash. And tonight we're learning that the driver of the cement truck is expected to be okay, doesn't have any serious injuries. But we just heard from the sheriff moments ago. Here's what he had to say. During the time of the incident, there were sprinkles, of precipitation on the roadway. Uh, the roadway surface uh, was slick. Uh, based on the information provided to our investigators, the driver of the cement truck stated that her vehicle started slipping and she wasn't able to control her vehicle. Uh, that vehicle impacted the west concrete barrier wall and unfortunately went over the overpass and landed on the uh, surface of the service road. Again, right now it's unclear if that driver is going to face any charges. Uh, crews are out here still cleaning up as well as hazmat. This intersection still closed off. You might even be able to see uh, quite a few people out here, just kind of onlookers uh, taking this all in as uh, traffic is diverting through this parking lot. Just a tragic day here on the east side. We're live on the east side tonight. Matthew Seedorf, Fox 26 News.